Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. This is a random message reading for the 29th of September 2022. So whoever's tapped on this channel, this is a random message, a random message reading for the 29th of September 2022 for the collective and for you whoever's tapped on this channel. So let's see what message the universe would like to give us for our random message on 29th of September. Let's have a look. Okay. Wow, that looks amazing. So the first thing here I see we've got is the priestess, which tells us that this is a time that you will need to go through self-discovery. This is a time where you need to meditate and, you know, turn inward to discover your soul's true desire. So, you know, it, it's not a time for action. So, um, you know, you need to develop your intuitive gifts and trust the wisdom, uh, the wisdom that you receive. And, you know, the divine will guide you and lead you to the right answers. Now, I feel that with the Knight of Swords that there's been some, you know, um, you've been driven. So you have become, you know, you are focused, you are driven. You know, there's two parts of you. There's parts of you that's confused. You know, uh, there's a part of you that wants to take action and go move forward and do the things that you want to do. Uh, but other other sections, you know, are stopping you. There's doors that are closed and, you know, there's an energy, some negative energy that's not letting you move forward. Uh, but I do feel by the three of cups it tells us that soon there'll be news worth celebrating so there will be some announcements where it will give you the freedom and you will be able to move forward uh, you will give time for gratitude you're going to be very ecstatic about this situation because you're finally it's like you know finally you're going to be able to move uh, this negative energy has had you uh, you know it, it's kept you down it's kept you limited um, but soon on you know from the 29th of September and moving forward uh, but this random message is telling us that a strength is coming. The universe is sending you an amazing strength. And with this strength, it'll be a time for a great joy and success. <clears throat> Look at these two major arcanas sitting side by side, which tells me that truly you're going to get gather the strength that you've been needing, that you've been wanting, uh, that finally the universe and this new vibration is coming out. It's sending you. You will have all this strength that you want. And I feel that, you know, there will be some compassion that will bring about some forgiveness with this strength. And you will realize that you are stronger than you know. And, you know, with this, um, there will be plans made. So you are making plans around September 29th, 2022 you will start making plans you're going to get you're going to get a push a sign from the universe to move forward you will be motivated you will get the strength that you want and all is going to start making sense by the page of swords it tells us that you will be insightful and you know um, there will be some exciting intellectual challenges that you will meet um, let's see let's see what these challenges are i just like to clarify that just to see what challenges are coming your way that you need. Let's see what these challenges are. Are they about your financial, about love? What are they about? Okay, they're about love. So there is some insight, some information that you're getting about a love that you have, uh, you know, you've invested a lot of love and time with this love and a lot of sacrifice. You've sacrificed also with this love. So it tells me that, uh, you know, all the care and all the all the forgiving and all that time that you sacrificed, uh, trust your intuition because um, and follow your heart because, you know, this this exciting challenge is going to be met and it's going to come through and you're going to be successful with it. So, you know, the Queen of Cups uh, is sitting there very strongly. Uh, she's very solid. And it, it tells me that, you know, uh, trust your intuition. The universe is going to send you a, a good uh, white energy. You're going to be in a very high vibration mode where you will be able to think straight. And once you start thinking straight, all systems will go. So that's a wonderful message there. Let's see what our lover's oracle and our romance oracle would like to add, add to that. Let's see what they, oh wow, very soon. So it tells me here very soon, clearly um, you will have to decide 
what's coming. So something very soon, there's a romantic decision that's going to happen very soon um, from an amazing past life relationship. Now, this could be a soulmate connection. This could be a past life connection, a past, you know, life partner. It's, it's a relationship that you have already known each other before, either in this life or past life. But you will, when you do, you know, meet this person or, you know, uh, very soon, it tells us. So when you meet this person or, you know, interact with this person, this energy that you will be interacting, you will get this energy between you. It's a past life relationship. It's a past, uh, you know, connection. Uh, let's see some clarification about that. Right. Okay. So don't let old beliefs and old religious factors destroy this relationship because, um, there is love coming, there is healing coming. So don't, you know, don't let anything that's, you know, primitive or racial or anything like that get in, 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 in between of this amazing, amazing, very soon love to, to begin. So, you know, there is an amazing love story happening. Don't let anything negative ruin it or destroy it. Um, others of you could be going back to some past love but there is a whole new energy about it. It's an amazing energy and it's happening very soon. This is just a random message for the 29th of September. Okay, wow, look at this. And the oracles tell us, don't make decisions based on guilt. So don't make any decisions based on guilt. It should be based on pure love and from, a, from, a, from the right, you know, upright heart. Um, for it only being true to yourself that you can be true to others. So don't make any decision based on guilt. Make sure that you, your gut instinct, that's why we had the queen there. You make sure that you've got your gut instinct. Go by your intuition. Go by your intuitive because, you know, you will you will have that strength. You will have that power to make the right choices. And um, tell yourself that you deserve to be happy. You can allow yourself to have joy in this life. Don't forget, my dear, we only have one life, you know, one life here. We have to make the most of this beautiful life and, um, you know, cherish it. And I wish you the best with that because I, I feel that, you know, the universe is going to help you, give you the strength to be able to make the right decisions so that you can, uh, you know, follow your heart and follow your dreams and meet the desires that you've always wanted. So I wish you the best with that. That was just a random message for the 29th of September. And thank you very much. Namaste. God bless. And thank you for watching.